New video you'll only see on 10 TV showing a miles long chase across cities during which the driver of a semi hit multiple vehicles and slammed into a police cruiser. Court documents say it started when Columbus police got a report of a semi hitting a building and driving away. Angela Ann walks us through the dash cam video tonight. We are northbound Carl. He's got sparks and damage. It all started around three in the morning Saturday. Police begin chasing a semi truck in northeast Columbus. He's going over the roundabout, northbound Carl. And looks like his truck's on fire. He just broke his gas line. And he's you'll see a tra trail of fire northbound Cleveland Avenue. Once the sirens go on, the semi stops, but then starts backing up. Oh, shit. He's trying to back into me, radio. He's trying to ram me. The semi begins driving away again, police chasing it through neighborhoods. Speeds are 35. He's still got sparks and flames. The chase continues, and the semi truck still sparking. He's slowing down. His door is open. And he's got to try to bail here. Uh, he tried to hit a car that was southbound. And we're off northbound again. And just moments later, he's trying to hit a cruiser. Uh, he just. We just five the cruiser, just five the cruiser, 9011. Get a squad to 9011. The semi driver backs up toward a police car again before heading into Worthington. He takes out a sign, drives past police cars, and then heads south down High Street. And after hitting another car, the driver bails out of the semi. I got him! I got him! I got him! Multiple officers chase him down. And that was Angela Ann reporting. Court documents say the driver is this man, 42-year-old Gregory Ivory of California. He was arraigned this week on two charges of felonious assault. A judge set his bond at $250,000.